finally, there's this one here, which is um, maybe we won't spend too much time on because in a future release, uh, when drawings have a lot more improvements, we'll, we'll spend more time on it then. But we are uh, starting more on uh, a system of 3D annotations. So the ability to create annotations uh, within your viewport and understand what's going on. So in the past, for example, if I create a drawing and I just clean that up, so let's have my drawing here and we'll decrease the size of that drawing and shift it around here. And in the past, this is how you would create dimensions. And that's really, well, poor for the, for the user experience. But now we have all of this stuff. So I'll just make that black and you can see how um, now it becomes a lot more uh, user friendly. You know, they can see what's going on when they're measuring things. And uh, I guess that's part of making uh, a proper full annotation environment is to have all of these indicators. So for example, if I then put a, a plan level on somewhere, for example, like that, yep, that's RL0. And of course it will show in 3D as well. So this is all just kind of stuff. So this was the old system. If I just turned that off, which is not very good and it would generate it when you create the drawing, but the new system is, uh, well, a lot better in that regard. You can actually see what you're doing before you finally generate your drawing. Yeah. There you go. That's your drawing. Okay. Interesting. That's good. Looking good. Yeah, but um, there's still a huge amount of work to be done on this, but it, it is a start to provide this sort of interactive um, 3D annotation, but uh, it'll get better and better. Yeah.